5 seconds to go. Start. Petitioner forfeits his rights to get any notice for the second time as per the proviso contained in section 22 of the Act. Council has further submitted that the court below has rightly held that the non payment of rent during the pendency of the petition itself is a sufficient notice to the tenant. Council has relied upon the judgment of the Honorable Supreme Court rendered in the case of V. Dhanpal Chatier versus Yeshodai Amal 1979 to RCR rent 352. In the present case, since the petitioner did not make the payment of rent during the pendency of the rent petition or during pendency of appeal, therefore, he has rightly been ordered to be evicted. Qua framing of the issues, counsel for the respondent had submitted that the respondent landlord had made specific pleadings in the rent petition qua the date of agreement, duration of the agreement, rate of rent, increase in rent and qua the other contents of this written agreement between the parties. As per order 8 rules 3 and 4 CPC, the petitioner tenant was required to reply these assertions specifically. However, no specific reply was given by the petitioner tenant. Only a vague kind of denial was inserted in the written statement. Hence, any vague denial has to be taken as an admission on the part of the petitioner. Council has relied upon the judgment rendered in the case of Satpol Singh v. Hukam Chand 1991 PLJ 392 to support his contention on the issue of non-registration of the agreements in question, council has submitted that the court below has rightly held the same to be only directory in nature. Council has relied upon the judgment rendered in the case of Utsav De versus Sushil Kumar Badraja 2019 1 RCR rent 188. Still further, council has relied upon a judgment rendered in the case of Gurbak Singh versus Sardara Singh 1994 1 PLR 396 Punjab and Haryana to buttress his arguments that in case the lease deed is admitted then eviction can be effected even if the said lease deed is not registered relying upon the provisions of section 25 of the act the council has contended that this provision enshrines upon the tenant a duty to pay the rent as per the agreement latest by 15th day of the month, failing which he is liable to pay interest at the rate 15 percent for the period of delay. The same section requires that if the tenant fails to pay the rent during pendency of the petition, then his defense has to be struck off and the case has to be decided on the basis of pleadings of the landlord alone. Therefore, the court below has not committed any illegality or irregularity in setting aside the order of framing of issues by the rent authority. The payment of areas of rent along with 15 percent interest has also been rightly ordered by the appellate authority in terms of provisions contained in section 38 subsection 10 of the act. Accordingly, it is prayed by counsel for the respondent landlord that the present petitions be dismissed with heavy and exemplary cost, being a blatant misuse of the process of the court. Having heard counsel for the parties, this court finds that the main issues involved and argued in the present case are whether any application by tenant for rejection of the eviction petition filed by the landlord on the ground of known service of notice upon him as required by section 22 of the act is at all maintainable, whether known issuance of a notice upon the tenant in the prescribed format as required by section 22A of the act renders the petition as not maintainable. 
whether not giving a notice in the prescribed format before filing of the eviction petition on the ground of non payment of rent would defeat the right of the landlord to seek recovery of possession even if there is default in payment of rent during pendency of the petition whether registration of the rent agreement lease deed under the act is mandatory what is the effect of non registration of rent agreement under the punjab rent act to appreciate the above said points it is appropriate to have a reference to the provisions of the act which are relevant for decision of the issues involved in the case stop